If you want to use Secure folder on a Samsung S25, start by opening settings. And you will start probably from this screen from the top, so you will have to keep scrolling until you find security and privacy. Then go below for more security settings and you will have to open a secure folder. Now we can find short description of the folder. You can click continue. Click continue again to grant all the permissions and now it's actually creating a secure folder. So you will have to just be patient and wait a little bit until it will be finished. It will take probably around 10 to 20 seconds and then we will be able to actually use it. And for sure I'm going to show you step by step how you can use this folder properly. Now we have to set pattern, peer or password to protect our data. And right now we can also allow, uh, allow lock reset with a Samsung account. So if you forgot your screen lock, you can reset the folder with your Samsung account. In my case, I don't want to do this. So and now I have to click next. And as you can see here, I have secure folder. If I'm gonna tap right here, I can actually go into customize. So right now I can rename my custom folder. I can change color of this folder, but also I can change icon of the folder. If I change everything, I can click apply. And by going here, I can go into settings. And here I can change some options, like for example, automatic lock of secure folder. So as default when the screen turns off, but in my opinion, the best way to actually select each time I leave application. You can also add this into the folder. I'm gonna actually hide this. I mean, let's go back here. I would like to actually get it. I thought that we can actually remove it from the home screen instead of apps screen. So we have to just go back and turn it on. And I'm going to also show you how easily you can add and remove some applications. So let's go here, let's open it. And right now, when we are in the folder, we can here change the, uh, this log type. And when we tap here, we'll get it back in this uh, application folder. So now let's log in. And if you want to add some apps, uh, just simply select them like that and you can click add and they appears uh, just right here but if i want to remove some apps from the folder then let's go into sort i believe no it's not here customize settings yeah we have to go into the apps i believe no, okay, so this is actually the good question, how we can actually remove them from the folder. Okay, I'm not actually sure, but if you want to add an additional applications, then you can simply go into plus, and here you can select any application that you want to add, but there's actually no way to actually remove them. So if you know how to do this, you can also leave that information in the comments, and if you find it useful, please leave a like and a comment below.